And when I get tired of screaming hate-filled screeds at the crowd, I pull down my pants oh. and I shove the microphone right up my own ass. Oh God! Wait, no! Okay, all right. And I pull it out and I it all over the stage. Oh God! No! Oh, oh, jeez. Well, I mean, if the audience was into it, <laughs> send that man to hell. This is a certified hood classic. You think everything get funny for their YouTube shit, bro? I'm just, I'm not I'm not being funny, bro. That we ain't cool, bro. What's up, family man? It's your boy Quizzy Man. Today we're getting ready to check out Purgatoni episode two. <laughs> you already know my boys, man. I just need y'all to do me a quick favor, man. And this one, <laughs> it's something real small, man. Hit the like button, go down below, subscribe to your boy, man. And without further ado, let's get started. Hi there, my name is Tony Purgatelli. This is Purgatory and you're dead. Uh, your name <laughs> is JJ Allens? <laughs> Guilty as charged. Boy, that boy, who who the hell? The same person that took a bite out of crime took a bite out of your head, boy. What the fuck wrong with you? Boy, this man, Snicker, Scott, boy, this boy got scuff marks on his face, nigga. What the fuck? Boy, I'm finna get on your teardrop mustache. This nigga is definitely off a of Breaking Bad, boy. This nigga was a, a dog turned into a human. Stupid ass, boy. This nigga got, uh, what the fuck is them teeth? This nigga got a, this nigga got a gap? <laughs> this nigga head look Pac-Man, boy. <laughs> Nasty nigga got a dent in his shit. It says here your occupation's listed as a musician. Hey. I'm uh, more of a performance artist. Uh-huh, yeah, okay. And when I get tired of screaming hate-filled screeds at the crowd, I pull down my pants oh. and I shove the microphone right on my own ass. Oh, God. Wait, no! And okay, all and right. And I pull it out and I shit all over the stage. Oh, God, no. Oh, oh, geez. Well, I mean, if the audience was into it. <laughs> send that man to hell! They were not. Wait, what, 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 was the music at least good? Oh, no, it was terrible. Maybe there's like, I, I don't know, another side <laughs> of you? No. Everything I've told you is a hundred percent me. You sound like a real piece of shit, JJ. <laughs> just, just gonna yeah. type it in here. Piece of shit. Uh, I mean, <laughs> I tried, yeah. but oh, god damn it. You know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and type that twice. Yeah, there you go. Piece, piece of, of shit. shit. Yeah, okay, maybe a third time. <laughs> piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> he loved it! He loved it! What's up there, buddy boy? This client comment card I got is one star. He said I was rude. He said it was abrasive, lacking empathy. God, Jesus, what a fucking prick. Tony, Tony, Tony. We asked some clients to rate their caseworkers so we can become better at our jobs. Better at serving them. Well, so you can be better, really. I'm already better. The betterest, <laughs> in fact. <sighs> Big head much, huh? Maybe. No, boy, this man. I, you know, I don't, I don't really like where this conversation is going. I, I really don't like. I don't really. I don't, I don't like the way I started it. I don't like the way it was going. So I'm just gonna say this: that man is, uh, 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 he's an asshole, but he's good at his job, and you know he's good at his job, and we know he's good at his job, and Tony knows, boy. Tony, you need to take notes, my boy, <laughs> or hair care advice or something. Goddamn, cut it off. Oh, I freaking hate you, Chad Bradley. What was that, Tony? Oh, I said I. Uh, Highly rate you, Chad Bradley. <laughs> uh, you oh, soft. speaking of high ratings, check out my comment cards, Tony. Five stars. Five stars. Five stars, Tony. Oh, I remember that guy. <laughs> Wasn't he a serial killer? That's right. And by the time I was done with him, he was ready to go to hell. Man, Chad Bradley, I think you really understand me. Maybe you're the first person to ever understand me. And I love you, Chad Bradley. <laughs> Oh no, you be freaky as hell, don't I love your Chad Bradley. No boy. <laughs> Why is these niggas beards so off the wall, boy? What the fuck? Look like Bart's hair. Hey, who's that motherfucker giving me the evil eye? Oh god. Oh, that's my coworker Tony. He's uh, you know, kinda rude, abrasive, lurking empathy, but he's okay in my <laughs> book. Any friend of Chad Bradley is a friend of mine. Oh, no, no, uh -oh. I don't need any friends. That's fine. Thanks. My best friend. You're my <laughs> best friend now, Tony. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. All right. Thanks a lot. Enjoy hell. 
Yeah, that guy was a real scary motherfucker, Chad Bradley. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, Tony, but I got to know him, and I made that trademark Chad Bradley connection. You've got to find that nugget of humanity in every soul. Do as the Chad man does, you know? Yeah, but that J.J. Allen's guy, the only nugget he had probably fell out of his ass on the stage. <laughs> Tony, if you're happy, they're happy. That's what I always say. Look at this. I'm going to write a comment card just for you right now. It's oh, from your buddy nice. Chad. That's nice, man. Chad, Chad Bradley probably ain't that bad. It says... Five star friend. Oh, all right. I, uh, Come on. This now. isn't actually a legitimate review, though. It's not an official document. In fact, you better give that back, Tony. Just to be oh, safe. Okay. All right, Tony. Good Chad, Chad. Well, fuck you too, Chad Bradley. Fuck you too. Glad we had this time together. Mwah. He kissed him. I know that short, fat, bald little knock. Tony, goddammit, what is it? Hey, hey, I, uh, Death, I got a problem with one of my coworkers. Yeah, well, I've got a problem with one of my employees, but I don't come down to you <laughs> about it. Why do you bring all your problems to me? Yeah, so Chad Bradley and me, right? We do the same job. You didn't care. But I'm really trying here, trying to get to know my clients, and they're still giving me one-star reviews. And Chad Bradley's clients are all, thank you, Chad Bradley. Five stars, Chad Bradley. I can't wait to get raped by a demon, Chad Bradley. Wait, what the fuck is going on up here, boy? <laughs> this man really needs to calm down, bro. His emotional stability is off the charts, bro. I don't, well, I don't know if that I've explained that quite. His emotional stability is fucked up. How about that? That's a better way of saying it. I, I can't take is it. Is there a reason you don't complain to your actual superior, Jeremy? Cool, because Jeremy's fucking terrifying. He's just a demon made of eyeballs. Hey, he's right there, Tony. Oh, fuck. Oh. Sorry, gold Jeremy. You gotta. You can't sneak up on a guy like that. Okay, so spit it out, Tony. What do you want me to do? Can't you move Chad Bradley to another department or on a different floor in a different plane of existence? Or Tony, oh. Chad Bradley has been here a lot longer than you. Technically, he outranks you. Wait, 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 Th there's a ranks? You're ranking us? Uh, it's not an official ranking, it's more of a personal ranking of who I like best, but oh man, okay. let me tell you, it is Chad above you. Chad's not going anywhere, Tony. You might as well get on the Chad train. With the what? The Chad train. It goes Chadley Bradley, Chadley Bradley, Chadley Bradley, Chadley oh, Bradley, stop it, Chadley stop Bradley, it. Chadley stop Bradley, it. Chadley stop Bradley, it. Chad Bradley. Oh, oh, fuck, that was terrifying. Why'd you do that? Bottom line, Tony, is that the <laughs> only way you're getting away from Chad Bradley is if he requests to transfer away from you. And he won't because Chad Bradley likes everybody, even you. Fuck if I know why, but... Hey, boss man, I remember that you liked Red Velvet and... Speak of the devil. Chad Bradley, a little cake you shouldn't have. Oh my god! On, Just man. wanted to show my appreciation. Love you, boss. Oh, hi, Tony. <laughs> Love you too, buddy. Mwah. That's not even a fucking cupcake for them, bruh. Like, you, talk, you see this hand grab that, his little skinny, bony-ass hands and shit, went down and grabbed that shit. This nigga want to be Knight Rider so damn bad, bruh. And here's another thing, man. I'm going a, I'm to a be honest. When I, when, I think of, when I think of Tony, right, when I think of Tony, man, I think of, man, he just needs to just, he needs to start living life more. Like, I don't know how, I mean, everybody's really dead and the time is, but I'm just saying, if you want to be better, you don't hate on the next man. You just become better, bro. Like if Tony would actually care about his job just a little bit more and care about the souls that he literally has in the palm of his hands, bro. One click can send them to heaven or hell. Eternal damnation, bro. So I'm just saying like, bro, you have a lot of power, bro. And sometimes I don't even think people know the position that they in. I don't think that they know. And I think that that's the reason why he can't appreciate shit because he doesn't even realize the kind of position that he's in. And if he wants to be like Chad Bradley, which let's be honest, he doesn't really want to be like him, but he wants to have, I, I feel like he wants to have what Chad Bradley has. And that's the likability. I really think because... It, it's just so many signs that he wants it. And it's just like, you know, just even hating on him is no reason to hate on Chad because Chad has not done nothing wrong to you. So I'm just saying, you should ask that nigga for advice, bro. Ask him for advice, bro. Somebody out here is acting like Tony. And I'm here to tell you, bro, stop. Stop with your little ball hating ass. Well, I love you, guy. Anyway, like I said... Yeah, like you said, if Chad Bradley requests a move, then no more Chad Bradley. What? No, you're twisting my words. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And if I make Chad Bradley dislike working near me, then perhaps Tony, I can get I, him to... I can hear you. I can hear you scheming right <laughs> now. All I have to do is make Chad Bradley hate me, and it's adios, Chad Bradley. T Tony, oh, are you forming a guy. plot? Yeah. Are you plotting <laughs> move office hijinks? Into place to Tony, like if you do one hijink, I swear to God. Oh, I can't wait. Tony, Bye-bye, Chad Bradley. Don't do it. He not listening to shit that you saying, deaf. <laughs> I don't know your other name, uh... Okay, so how to piss off Chad Bradley so much that he wants to transfer, uh, He's so freaking positive, you... <gasps> 
my horrible clients! Who can I pass off from my workload to his that'll absolutely destroy him? It's not gonna go how you Social want it Social media celebrity? Oh, Chad Bradley, just wait till you beat Sugar Beef! <laughs> All right, watch up, wankhead. Sugar Bear here, and today I'm gonna show you an exciting new way to show your muff off. Oh your my muff? god, there's no way he'll be able to handle you. Yeah. Is that how us influencers, quote, quote, is that how we look to the world, bro? Hey man, you know, you wanna get a chance, wanna rub the nips and show your muff off. Like, is that what is that? I don't know, man. I think we all know somebody like that. For some reason, he reminds me of PewDiePie. Yeah, mate, you love it. You want a bit of this pudding? Take a Ugh. closer look, you filthy fucking wanker. Chad Bradley's gonna hate you, and then he's gonna hate me. Here she comes, You're Chad a cockwank, fat little cockwank. Cockwank, you're a poxy cock. Like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> oh, fantastic! Okay. Okay. Hey there, uh, Chad Bradley. Uh, I need your help with a client. Lay it on me, Tony. How can the Chadster make your day a little less badster? <laughs> one more Laffy Taffy joke like that, and we're ending the whole video. Okay, well, I got this one client, you see, I just can't seem to, uh, relate to. You know, I, I can't figure her out, and, uh, I'm just too bad at my job, you know, too not enough Chad Bradley, I guess. Tony. If being not enough like Chad Bradley was a crime, I'd be the only free man in the universe. Send me the problem client. Oh, you're fit, you fucking bellend. Ha <laughs> ha, aw, you flatter me. My name's Chad Bradley, and you are Sugar Bee? Sugar Bear. I had to use a mm. B instead of an R because that was taken, but it's still Sugar Bear, you fucking okay. wank. Wank! Huh. What? Sugar Bear! Oh, I got your V right here. Why don't you dip your <laughs> chips in it, you fucking spin? <laughs> you freaky bitch. All right, you pissy titwank. Say hello to your new pal, Chad Bradley. Hey, yo, hey, yo, what it do? It's your boy, Seabrad. And it's me, Sugar Bear, coming to you live from the other side. Oh, God, what, what's going on here? Oh, look at this fat little shit. What a <laughs> wank knob. You use the most colorful language, and I find it charming as all heck. All right, that's it for now. Bye, bastards. Well, this has been a really fun experience, Sugar Bear. I've had a great time getting to know you, but I think it's time we wrap this up. Cool, you're fit. You're a fit cunt, you are. And you're a fat cunt. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, lovely to meet you. Bye. Mwah. Oh, man. That shit look like it hurt, boy. I'm saying, my boy. Burst up into flames, bro. <laughs> shit. Chad Bradley, she was the worst, right? I mean... I bet she's got you rethinking your whole employment situation here. Tony, I want to thank you for bringing Sugar Bear to me. She was a bit of a handful at the start, but once I turned on a bit of that old Chad Bradley charm, I cracked her wide open. Hell was the best fit for her, and she agreed. Oh, oh really glad for you, Chad Bradley. I'm glad it all worked out. Tony, don't think for a second I don't know what you're trying to do. Oh, yeah, well, what are you, what are you doing? You're challenging me to become a better caseworker. I appreciate yeah. every opportunity for personal improvement. Love you, buddy. Oh, God, that's right. Chad Bradley's never gonna hate me. He's too nice. He doesn't hate anybody. <laughs> what if the whole office hated him? Oh, hold on, buddy. I left something behind. Mwah. There it is. Oh, oh, stop it. Just stop. Stop, Chad. Stop. Good. Oh, this dude is a fucking cup. hater, bro. Again? Look at him. Oh, uh, yeah. So it turns out that it was uh, Chad Bradley that got rid of all the coffee. Uh -huh, sure, he, he poured it all in the toilet. You can go in there and see it. It's you know, Chad Bradley's right. I need to cut back on caffeine. I'm switching to orange juice. Hey, guys, there's free coffee in the toilet. You're nasty. You're worse than that nigga that, that what, what's that one dude that, that was making that toilet wine? Remember that? I don't know what cyanide and happiness fatuation is with toilets and drinking and sipping and farting in jars and shit, but it's not healthy. It's not. Who sent this disgusting memo? Oh yeah, the memo. I, I got one of those too. Looks like Chad Bradley sent everybody a picture of his butt. It's so disgusting. You can see the hole. No, it should just be a butt, actually. It's Chad Bradley's butt. Oh, what a hideous asshole. Yeah, okay. I'll just take all these so that your eyes aren't assaulted by uh, Chad Bradley's butthole anymore. Okay. Uh... Chad Bradley, my office now. Oh boy, here it comes. Chad Bradley's gonna get it. This dude is so, so uh, such a damn hater, bruh. 
Like, damn, bro. You are so hateful, mean-spirited, bro. I'm telling you, karma has a funny way of coming around, man. For, karma, I'm telling you. Y'all know, y'all know. Karma has a funny way of coming around, bro. You just, just as soon as you think, as soon as you think, everything is all cool. There, there go karma. Right in your face. Like a Halloween mask. So, Chad Bradley. Been busy today? Busy as a beeve. <clears throat> a bee. I heard about the toilet coffee thing and I thought, hey, maybe Chad Bradley wants the office to switch to orange juice. I'm a big fan of vitamin C. Everybody H -A -D, loves it. That is. Then I got the butthole memo. <laughs> That's when I knew. All knew what? That it was you, Tony. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Tony? You know I have all my employees' butthole prints on file, Tony. No, I did not know that. was that. clearly Wait, yours. Oh. You haven't had the pleasure of seeing Chad's butthole. No, never. Not as of yet. I it's don't. immaculate, Tony. It has perfect radial symmetry. No, Delph. It looked like you want a little bit something else from Chad, bro. Tell me it has perfect symmetry. That man did this. He did this. He was trying to tell us something. Him and Chad been... <laughs> Well, yeah, uh, a whole lot of that. I know he talked about his butt. Oh, and 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 here's here's another thing. When did it? Why is it a requirement for this office for you to have a butthole? It's like so you show up for for the job interview. You're like, hey man, want to apply for the job? Okay, great man. You know what? We're, we're short staff. You, you're I'm, you're hired immediately. Okay. All I need you to do is bring in your driver's license. Mm -hmm. I need you to bring your social security card. And like, okay, all right. And I need you to bend over and spread your cheeks and stop. I'm like, whoa, wait. Excuse me, bitch. It's like it was laser cut in solid marble. I squat down on one shot glass of bleach a day. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, this? Well, yeah, well, it's mine. It's my, uh... It's your butthole, Tony. Yeah. <laughs> and it's gross. It was Tony's it's the worst. Butthole. Tony's butthole. Tony's butthole. Tony's butthole. Tony shit. Tony 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 <laughs> guys, guys, we all hate Tony's butthole. Let's form a single file line and tell him to his face. Okay. Tony, your butthole was the worst thing I've ever experienced. No, it okay. gave me nightmares and I don't even sleep. It made me hate my butthole. <laughs> I think it was probably not so bad if my eyes were closed. You're in deep, deep that trouble, Tony. Nice. Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm the worst. I'm the one that tried to make Chad Bradley hate his job so he'd ask for a transfer and- What are you doing, Tony? And if I was a big angry mob, I'd probably shout stuff like, Hey, get Tony out of here and- we want Tony in a different department where Chad Bradley isn't in. Yeah. We want Tony in a different Get department where Chad Bradley yeah. isn't in. Yeah. Tony, you Gus son of a Bruce. bitch. Hold on, everyone. Wait just a second before we all start dogpiling on sweet little short bald sweaty Tony. Did you see his feet go up and shit as if he was trying to give him an elevated place to talk? Him and Def got something going on, my boys. You see him as a frustrated little wad of misguided aggression, but I see something else. Spunk. Moxie, determination. Tony saw something he wanted to change and he went for it, goddammit. Okay. I think we could all learn a lot from Tony's get up and go spirit. Yeah, I don't want to be, be farther away from you, Tony. I want to be closer to you. I want us all to be closer to each other. Aww. Aww. I didn't think I could cry, but you proved me wrong, Chad Bradley. God damn it, Chad Bradley! <laughs> <laughs> that boy went for the he went for the deal. Hey, <laughs> as my boy Dashy said, bro, that nigga he ran. He's supposed to ah, Chad Bradley. <laughs> These niggas is freaky as fuck, bro. He ran them ah, Chad Bradley. <laughs> He was done. He was fed up, bro. That, he was fed up. That nigga went. He ran to give him a blowjob. <gasps> Chad Bradley still has his underwear from the company picnic signed by the whole staff. Oh, yeah, Chad Bradley! Chad Bradley, you really do love us. Oh, I do. I do. I love you all. Look at my underwear oh. and know that I do. <laughs> You're the man, Chad Bradley. Oh, wow. Hey there, it's Chad Bradley. Look, I just I just wanted to say to oh didn't you hear Tony? Chad Bradley's gone. Oh Chad Bradley is gone? After all that? What happened? Did he actually request a transfer? No, silly! What? I was promoted <laughs> to Angel! Oh! I have powers now. Check it out. I can go big, small, big, small. Oh no, That's good it? Jesus. I can fly too and play harp. Well, please just tell me you're here cleaning out your desk, you know, getting your stuff so you can be gone forever to heaven. Oh, 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 Tony, time is irrelevant here and has no meaning. I've been in heaven for what? Gosh, seems like eons. Well, I'm back and better than ever. Okay. You know, I may have magic powers, but nothing beats wonderful companions. 
My Little Tony, friendship is magic. This may be purgatory, but with you guys, this is my heaven. Talk, oh, fuck yourself, Chad Bradley. <laughs> what was that, Tony? I said, uh, good luck on your shelves, Chad Bradley. What? Oh, Tony, I should put all my trophies on shelves. Like, just stop being such a bitch, bruh. Just, if you said something, talk, speak with your chest. You gotta put your chest out. No, you can't see because I got this green ass shit looking like a Jamaican lima bean and shit. But I'm saying, man, Jamaican string bean looking at, bro. I know I'm finna get on your shit. I'm the fuck down, bruh. Stop being so soft. You know what I'm saying? Like, one, if you gonna say some shit, say that shit. Stop being soft about it, Tony. Okay?